o'clock in morning, the most news in the morning period with day six Easter. Well, if you or your friends post pictures of yourself, drunk, or in other compromising positions on Facebook, you will want to hear this. A change to the company's fine print is raising questions online this morning about what happens to all of the information that you post on your page. Alina chose following the story for us. First of all, you shouldn't post pictures of yourself in compromising yeah, positions probably anyway. Probably not a good idea. <laughs> but there is something interesting that has people scratching their heads. Yeah. It was actually a blogger that found a That's change right. to the it, fine print. It's called the consumerist, and so we'll get to that in a second. But essentially, we're talking about the TOS, terms of service, um, with respect to Facebook. Karen, good morning, everybody. And it is probably something that most people who use Facebook have not heard about. About two weeks ago, the fine print explaining privacy rights on Facebook quietly and suddenly changed. Now, here's what happened. Facebook removed language that said its ownership of your content would end when you removed that content or closed your account. Now, what does that mean? It means that Facebook now will continue to have access to things like your personal photos and personal information. The blogs, as you might imagine, went crazy. The consumerist, published by Consumer Reports, responded by saying Facebook's new terms are tantamount to, quote, we can do anything we want with your content forever. So is that true? Well, possibly, according to legal experts, but Facebook CEO Mark Zuckerberg issued his own post trying to reassure users that they still control their own information, saying, quote, in reality, we wouldn't share your information in a way you wouldn't want. The trust you place in us as a safe place to share information is the most important part of what makes Facebook work. Still, some Facebook users are closing their accounts in protest. More than 18,000 members have joined groups against the new terms of service. Here is just some of what is being posted. Quote, these new terms are beyond insane. Someone has to put a stop to this. Another person who says he's a professional photographer wrote, quote, guess I'll be taking my stuff down. Bye-bye, Facebook advertisers. I won't be seeing your ads. And yet another person wrote, I'm scared knowing one day I might find a picture of me or even a family member that I didn't give permission to be used. I can't even delete anything I previously uploaded because they retain copies, which they will probably sell to some third party to make an easy buck. This sucks. Now, you know, keep in mind, thousands upon thousands of people here and use Facebook, they're perfectly happy. I personally don't have a Facebook account because I might be a little more sensitive than most about my personal information being shared. But, you know, the, the key thing here is a lot of people agree to those terms of service. Right without reading the fine print. And I think that's what's surprising to most people now is, wait a minute, I might have to look at this a bit closer. See, I'm dipping my toes in the Facebook water. I've oh, had maybe only 14 friends, you know, girlfriends from, from, from high school. You're about to get a lot more now that you've no, publicized but, your own Facebook. But what I'm wondering about the situation is, even though the, the CEO responded, they didn't change those terms. No, and listen, so it still seems a little murky. It, it does. Um, the truth is, is sometimes when things like this get publicized and more people learn about it and more people protest mm -hmm. uh, the change that sometimes they reverse that but right. we'll have to see what happens because there's also a lot of people that say even if you delete yourself from Facebook and that's you right. close up your account that that still is retained in that's in right their archives. let's say an email you send that right. would be retained in the archives yeah of course so all anyway right. it's all think, interesting think twice guys I mean I know you're talking about you're talking about your own personal pictures that you're just putting out there for the world I to see. never post drunk photos online yeah. well you don't get drunk yeah, you're right Thanks, Selena.